Weather Center looking at some sunshine. He said there's some sunshine out there somewhere. I just know it because those temperatures, especially Tuscaloosa, check out the Tuscaloosa Tower Apartments camera. There's some blue peeking out from time to time there in T-Town. It's a little bit warmer too. Our WVTM 13 live Doppler radar camera. Those clouds, those cumulus clouds are certainly water loaded, so some showers are still a possibility today. Look at the temperatures though. 76 in Utah, 75 in Tuscaloosa, so it just takes a little bit of sunshine to peek through and get those temperatures cranked up. And 70 Two in Gadsden and up the I-59 corridor over the past several days. It's been a little bit cooler, but now they're sharing those warmer temperatures with us now. Almost at 80 along the Gulf Coast. Temperatures will get really close to that point over the next several days, and we still do have more warm air on tap. Everything continues to move from west to east. Story's not changing. It's almost like a summertime pattern where we're on repeat. And once we get that overhead heating like we're seeing right now, we start to see some showers developing on the WBTM 13 live Doppler radar looking northward towards Gardendale. Just a couple of those showers can really dim the view if you're downtown northern Coleman County. It's a little bit heavier as you get closer to Huntsville and into portions of the Tennessee River. That's really where the bulk of the rainfall and the flood threat still remains. There are several tributaries of the Tennessee River in the northern third of the state that are on alert for any kind of possible flooding because we have about two or three more days of waves of rain that are going to be moving through the Tennessee Valley. But you can see now that the visible satellite is illuminated, some breaks in the cloud cover, more sunshine southern Bibb County, Green County too, and a little bit of sunshine peeking through around uh, the Peach Park and Durban Farms. Forecast high temperature today is 75, 77 on Thursday and still looking at temperatures about 10 degrees above average even as we head towards the weekend. Rain chances are still up though. We're looking at rain chances for Saturday and Sunday, but wanted to show you those rain chances come in waves. So there's the Thursday afternoon, same situation we're seeing right now. Friday afternoon, we've got that rain coming in in the afternoon, but then Saturday, check this out. This is 2 p.m., Sarah, okay? The rain really starts to build across the Tennessee Valley. Then we get to 6 p.m., and that's when the rain starts covering up areas of central Alabama, and it may hang tough through about 2, 3 o'clock in the morning on Sunday morning. So our rain chances, they start to really move in, keeping temperatures mild. That temperature may even bump up just a little bit as we head towards the overnight period because of the rain. So 70s and even some 60s, get used to it.